Hello everybody, welcome to another Rise of Civilizations video. Um, this is Dragothian, so I've been wanting to do this video all week. It's been an absolutely crazy week at work, uh, so I wasn't able to tear away uh, and get some more videos in for you guys, but uh, really excited to be here, uh, getting in front of you finally, and uh, looking to put up a bunch of content over the weekend. Um, just uh, for today, so we're going to do some exciting stuff. Uh, we're going to be getting a gold key uh, opening happening here. I think we've got about 62 or 63 keys um, that will open up and hopefully get some really good goodies. I had some really good luck with the last one I posted, so I'm hoping to get in the same luck this time. Uh, I'm also going to skill up my Richard. So uh, Richard's by no means ready to get maxed, but he's level 50, he's 6 star. Uh, I've got him uh, 5144, four, uh, and I believe I can get him up one more skill with these universal sculptures that I've got. And I'm hoping that I might get some more Richard sculpt sculptures whenever I do my gold key opening. So maybe I can get to two skills today. So we'll see how that goes. Um, hopefully we can get two, uh, but at least one. Uh, but I also, before I get started, I wanted to thank you all for, for subscribing, the, for those of you that already have. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. I'm, I'm looking to kind of build this channel and uh, make it specifically around Rise of Civilizations, just different content, uh, different uh, ways of doing things, and trying to fill some gaps that may be out there uh, where uh, we've got, you've got your troop guides, you've got your you know commander guides, your pairing guides, your T4, T5 guides. And, Looking to do some uh, some of that as well. Certainly, I want to fill up the channel with as much content as I can for you. But also, I'm looking to do something a little bit different. Um, you know, I, I know that uh, you know I, I'm an older gamer, so uh, you know I've got kids, I've got a wife, I've got a family, I've got a house to to maintain and all that stuff. But uh, maybe incorporate some of that into my videos and maybe bring my my four year old son in and let him kind of run the show a little bit. Uh, he can tell me what he wants to buy and we'll buy it and. Uh, you know, he loves to, <laughs> whenever I'm playing, he loves to uh, hit the, the farms like this. He likes to see all the stuff go up into the numbers at the top, so he enjoys that. He certainly loves the gold chest openings and things like that, too. So maybe for the next gold chest opening, uh, I'll have him do all the openings. He always has uh, the most amazing reactions. But um, if we get some uh, legendary commanders or legendary commander sculptures, I'll certainly have just as big of a reaction as he does. But... Looking to bring y'all some troop guides and, and not just infantry, cavalry, and archer, but the different civilizations for those uh, troops and which ones are going to work best in which situations, that kind of thing. Get real deep into it because we're really starting to get into the, the nitty-gritty of, of Rise of Civilizations where we've already got the Alliance Battlegrounds, K Kingdom versus Kingdom is coming up soon. A lot of battle stuff that's about to go down and uh, it seems like they're letting us do a lot of battling without having to waste a whole bunch of resources uh, like they have in the past so really looking forward to a lot of that other content uh, uh, like you saw in my other video Alliance Battlegrounds was awesome it was an awesome experience and I'm, I'm looking forward to doing it again it looks like it might happen every two three or four weeks um, it seems to be the frequency on what they're gonna do it on it's definitely not every week because it didn't come back this week um, so maybe two, three, or four weeks uh, intervals is when they'll do it. Maybe like a Mightiest Governor type of thing. But um, let's get into the video. Again, goal key opening today and Richard's skill up. Uh, some of the things that are coming are the troop guides, the commander tr uh, pairing guides. Uh, I do want to start working my way towards T5 troops. I know I'm only about 11 million, exp uh, 11 million power, but um, I don't mind throwing a little cash into the game if it's going to get me to T5 and get you some content that you guys want to see so if you want to see that kind of stuff and and uh you want to see me buying a bunch of stuff then uh go ahead and like and subscribe this video um comment below if that's something you want to do and uh, happy to have a conversation with anybody that wants to to join in also want to do some battle guides uh also want to get into live streaming i think that's going to be kind of fun i like the interaction that i have on ronnie's channel with uh, uh everybody that joins his live streams and we can go back and forth on different things and um share ideas so uh, that seems pretty fun. And then, um, again, the last thing is I want to bring a couple of my kids in. I've got four kids, so um, <clears throat> they like this kind of stuff. They like the YouTube portion of things, and I love the gaming and YouTube portion of stuff too, but they really enjoy it. So 
wanted to maybe bring them in and get them a little taste of what this is and see if they like it. But let's get to it. Let's get to the gold key opening. I'm really excited. I've been saving these up for about a week and a half and um, wanting to go in and get this stuff done. What am I doing? <laughs> Where's the tavern? What did I do with it? It's hard to find on the Ottoman civilization. All right, so I went ahead and burned all my silver keys. I'm not going to go through that. You might get a couple... Um, a couple epics in there but mostly it's just resources and uh, green commanders I mean who wants to see that but let's go one by one on these I don't want to burn them all in one thing and have a five second video so let's go one by one and see what we get so first one well, t first one out the bat a ten, th uh, 10 sculptures of Osman I'll take that this might be another really lucky video guys. I'm hoping I'm hoping it is y'all bringing me some good luck a bunch of stars okay Stars and XP. So I need XP in the worst way. Like, I've got so many commanders I want to get to at least level 50. And um, I am running out of experience books, it seems like, every day. Oh, there's a 10 of El Cid, too. So hopefully this is a, a prediction of things to come. I'm getting a bunch of 10 sculpture commanders. So we'll see how this goes. Getting some good amount of sculptures here. You can probably hear my kids in the background yelling and running around. It's late at night, too. They need to get to bed. <laughs> but uh, I'm having too much fun doing this, so we're going to keep on plugging away here. Five Richards. I needed that. I definitely needed that. I need Richard all day. I want to max him out, get him completely loaded up. I have zero luck with uh, Charles Martel, though. So... Wow, another Boudica. And I and so I don't have... The only maxed out epics that I've got are Sun Tzu. And I think I'm like one skill point away with Lohar. Um, everybody else is up there, but they're not they're not fully uh, there. So let's keep going, see if I get any more good stuff. Uh, so far, it's been pretty good. A uh, bunch of legendary and epic sculptures and experience books. There's another uh, legendary star and epic sculptures. I'll take that. All right, so it looks like we went through uh, below 50. There's some Cleopatra sculptures. I'll take that. Uh, we don't need any 10 of epics or any of that other stuff. Let's keep going. I mean, I'm, I'm loving all these sculptures. All these sculptures and all these experience tomes are really where it's at. Yes. I am in dire need of Charles Martel. I, mean, I don't know. I, sometimes I'm just... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I guess it's better to be lucky than good. I mean, what? I'll take it. <laughs> I mean, I'll I'll take it. I'm not gonna complain. And then I get a Gaius, of course. They gotta bring me back down to earth after getting 13 Charles Martel sculptures. They gotta give me Gaius Marius. I mean, okay. Here's some more Cleopatra. I'll take it. I'll take and another. <laughs> it seems I like get a good one and then Gaius. That's pretty much the bring me back down to earth. Um, pull. Man, this is a fantastic... And I've already got Sun Tzu maxed out, but I will take two more Cleopatra. This is a fantastic opening, um, key opening here. We've gotten a lot of sculptures. And there's another ten uh, by bars or bay bars. I'm not sure how you say that one. I wish they would have kept uh, Khalid in instead of going to bay bars, but it is what it is. Uh, man, I am getting so many sculptures... And then I get a Lancelot. I knew that I was going to get at least one or two of those Lancelots popping in. But, um, man, let's see. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Bunch of stars, a, a bundle of stars. That's good. I'll take that. Okay, here comes the Lancelots. All right. And I did not need those five Sun Tzu sculptures. I, I, I've got him maxed out. Let's keep going. So far, I mean, I am excited about this, uh, this opening so far. Well, it's starting to dwindle down now. And I get two more minutes. That's good. That's very good. Man, so many sculptures. I don't know if everybody wants to go ahead and... <laughs> I mean, I don't know if everybody wants to go ahead and open up their, their gold keys right now. But, like, now's the time. Oh, my God. There's so many... There's so many sculptures happening right now. I mean, just... I'm getting tens all over the place. Sculptures all over the place. Finally! This was the last new commander I have not been able to get. Um, it, I've been adding him up one and two and one and two every single time uh, to get him. So really excited to finally be able to summon him. That's good. I'll take that all day. More Sun Tzu. 
those are basically anytime I see those, those are basically just epic stars to me. Um, two more Chow Chow, that's good. Two more Double C. <laughs> I mean, how many have we got? I'm gonna have to add them all up. How many ten legendaries have we gotten? This was 63 or 64 gold keys. I've gotten a bunch of ten legendary, a bunch of ten epic, a bunch of singles. Holy crap! Holy crap! Look at this. I think I think the RNG is broken right now. I've only opened like 45 gold keys, and I've gotten a metric ton of legendary sculptures. I can't stop now, right? I gotta I gotta keep going all the way. I can't turn this off. There's Sarka. She's good. <laughs> um, I mean, hopefully, I mean, just they they just keep coming. They just keep coming. Legendary after, I mean, epic after epic. Ten, ten epics at a time. This has been by far the best gold key opening I've ever done. I mean, it's every other one. It's broken right now, guys. Start burning your keys right now. Leave me some comments below on what yours turn out to be. Maybe it's the time of the day. Like right now, it's 11.30 p.m. Eastern time in the States. So I think that's like 4.30 UTC. Um, wow. I mean, just I'm never opening keys in, until this time again. This is crazy. Let's see if we can end up with another 10 before. I mean, I doubt we will, but... <laughs> or maybe we will there's a 10 YSG to finish us off with the last key and to play I mean I should just end the video here right I mean the video can't get any better than what you just saw I mean that's this has been an absolute amazing gold key opening I mean first let's well let's summon Belisarius right because I've been waiting for him forever okay somebody's coming in Hey, son. <laughs> it's night night time. Okay. Have a good one, buddy. Good night. I don't know. So let's summon Belisarius. Um, I've been waiting for this since he came out. This was the one commander I could not get to pop for me in the keys. And then magically, this was, like I said, this was an absolutely crazy crazy key opening best i've ever had since i started playing the game um this is gonna be a great video okay so let's summon him real quick he is now summoned he is part of my repertoire the only two i don't have are constantine and saladin all right so let's go down the list let's go ahead and add up everybody um let's skill them up so let's go ahead and upgrade and it looks like we got the healing skill for that one for Boudica, YSG. So, I don't know if he actually got nerfed. Um, his skills are the same. I don't know if he did get the percentage nerf that they were talking about. They didn't. They haven't really posted any uh, patch notes. I'm waiting for those patch notes to pop out uh, to see if he actually got nerfed. But I got a, a ton of uh, reward compensation or whatever for having him at five one. So um, we've got YSG sculptures. Let's go ahead and use them. And we know where it's going, right? It's going to the second skill, which is just fine. Anything to, re to restore rage and increase the archer attack bonus. Um, he's going to be one of my primary archer commanders. Not that I'm going to have many archer armies out on the field, but I'll probably have one, and he'll be on my, he'll be on my archer team. So uh, let's go ahead and skill up Osman, too. We got 20 sculptures for him. And I think those are actually 20 sculptures. So I think he was at zero or close to it because uh, I just maxed his first skill out so I could level him up uh, to the next set of stars. Uh, same thing with Scipio. I think he was pretty close too. Um, so that's another level for him. And let's keep going. I think that's, I got a bunch of Cleopatra sculptures too, didn't I? Yeah, 19 out of 40. I think I had like three. So lots of Cleopatra sculptures. Of course, I got a ton of guys' sculptures, but uh, who cares about that? Uh, Bybars, yeah, let's go ahead and level him up. We might actually get two for him. Oh, we're just just short. He's he's just about to level uh, max his first uh, first skill there, and that's a pretty good skill. 
for AOE, getting up to 750. And then once we max him out and get his expertise, 1,000 AOE damage, that's on par with Sun Tzu. And uh, the combination of those two together would be pretty pretty devastating on the battlefield and obviously for barbs. These are, this guy's definitely a barb killer. Um, having the cab attack and the march speed bonus whenever you're killing, uh, you're, you're leaving um, after battle. So that's a good way to get around and kill as many barbs as you can in a short amount of time. It's good stuff. All right, let's uh, let's let's max out Julius Caesar's first skill too. How about that? Bam, there it is. So his first skill is maxed. Now we can go ahead and star him up and move on. We did get an El Cid one, but we're too short, which is fine. I have I'm in no rush to max up um, El Cid. We just had him on Mightiest Governor, and I could not have cared less. <laughs> I'm saving everything up. So our next one is uh, Julius Caesar on Mightiest Governor. I'm saving up to get the Charles Martel. Uh, so I can max him out. And we did get some Charles Martel sculptures. He's still short to get to the next skill, but uh, we'll keep going on that. All right, so the next thing I wanted to do, let's skill up Richard. Let's see what we have here. So, oof, we were just short. So I'm going to use my universal sculptures since I told you I would skill him up. Yeah. And we're going to upgrade him. I would... I think they're all good. Yeah, I figured it was gonna eat start evening out because I got four and four on the last two skills. I'm not I'm not upset with that. I mean, damage taken reduced is a big deal to me. The counter attack damage not so much. Um, certainly would have liked the extra attack and defense for infantry since I use him as a primary infantry commander. And uh, same thing with the healing effect enhancement would have been really nice. Uh, I'll get there. <laughs> I'll get there eventually, but. I did need to get this one up too, so it's not like it's um, wasted points. Uh, I'm too short. I'm too universal sculpture short of scaling him up one more time. Uh, so whenever I get that, I'll go ahead and scale him up and get him another point. Um, very, very close. Okay. Wow, guys. What a great key opening video. That was amazing. Um, just to kind of reiterate again. So had a blast with you on this video, but... This is a taste of more to come. We're, we're looking to um, just get you all some more content. I want to I wanna bring some more things to the table. Uh, you saw my son a little bit ago. He was going to bed. Um, I guess my wife is tucking him in and reading him a bedtime story. But I uh, want to bring him in and want to bring um, maybe a daughter or two of mine in uh, just to, to have some fun with me and do this too because I want to involve them in everything I'm doing. Uh, I'm, I'm away enough as it is with work so um again really exciting video today had a blast uh, please like and subscribe and uh, i'll see y'all next time i'm uh gonna be trying to pump out a bunch of videos this weekend so that you have uh, some things to watch if you're interested and uh look forward to reading your comments have a good one Take